have the fastest player in five different sports games, and I'm going to attempt to score in an impossible way with each one. And I'm not wasting any time because I'm spinning the wheel of sports games. Five sports games, five of the fastest people in the entire world. The fastest in their sport, and we start with FC24. The fastest player in FC24 is also one of the best players in the game as well. Kylian Mbappe with a 97 pace is one of the best players in the world. And for Mbappe, he's got to go coast to coast. He's got to outrun everybody from our side of the field all the way to scoring a goal. And just for fun, we are going to time all of these. Not that it's a competition or anything like that, but I'm just curious to see how long it's going to take me to score these type of goals with all these players or all these type of shots and everything in every sport. And where is Mbappe? And I have no idea why I just lost the ball. But find Mbappe. Where is Mbappe here? See, this is why I don't know anything about this sport. I'm looking for him here. Where in the world? Oh, there he is at the bottom. Okay, well, first things first. To go coast to coast, Mbappe has to touch the ball. That is the first thing we need to do. So let's get him the ball. Mbappe, though, you got to go backwards. Mbappe, you're going backwards here, my friend. Get that ball, Mbappe. I see you're trying to get it. You can't even get it. Come on, Mbappe. Thank you. Messi's creeping up. He wants the ball. See you later, Messi. See you later, Messi. Come on. We beat Messi. We got to go all the way, Mbappe. That was a good one right there. Split the defenders. This could be our chance. Get past that defender. Mbappe, take your time now. Take your time. You just got to score. No. Mbappe finally got a shot. That was our best chance. We beat Messi in the foot race. Split the defenders. And we don't find it in the back of the net there. I can't believe we just tripped on our own teammate. Let's see this one here. Split the defenders. Good job, Mbappe. Where do I want to go? And I want to cut more towards the middle. Mbappe, don't lose the ball. He didn't lose it. Did not lose possession. Now you just got to work it. Mbappe, this is where you thrive here. This is where you thrive. Mbappe, no! How did he save that off his foot? A few moments later. We got absolutely robbed. We're having some good attempts now. We just can't finish. I don't like this, though. Two defenders right there. Did not lose the ball, though. We are still going. Mbappe, we are still going. We are flying in now. Don't lose the ball. Score! Oh, my goodness. A few moments later. First half of the field here. Mbappe got lucky, kind of. Now we turn on the burners. Come on, Mbappe. Please cut down towards the middle. Cut in. And Pape, don't lose it. No, I should have slowed up a little. Eventually. Well, because we couldn't get it against Argentina, we're doing it against a way easier opponent, I believe. Atlanta United in the MLS. And Mbappe, we are flying. If we were flying past everybody before, I imagine we're going to fly past them even worse this time. And Mbappe, come on. You got to score this. Mbappe, it is that easy. Argentina was super tough, but against an MLS team, Mbappe dominates the competition and gets us that goal. It took us 11 minutes. So Coast to Coast is done in FC24. Now it's time for MLB The Show. And for MLB The Show, there's a few players with 99 speed, but I'm going with Ellie De La Cruz, a man who's hit for the cycle this past season and also stole home plate. And with Ellie, we are doing this in practice mode. We are at Oracle Park in San Francisco with the famous Triples Alley in right center field and there's no way we might get this done in the first attempt that's exactly where you need to hit it but an unfortunate bounce we got the third base but they didn't throw it yet now they throw it it's a perfect throw to the plate and we are out but i was gonna say that's exactly where we need to hit it and the reason why i'm doing practice is because we can keep getting up every single time with ellie de la cruz we don't have to worry about anything and we can keep resetting the play as many times as i want but that's exactly where we want to hit the ball on this part. I'm going to have to get a little lucky, I would imagine, here. There it is. Okay, right center field. That's exactly where we need it. Come on, we need a good bounce. Sit ball. That is perfect. Sat in the corner. This is going to be the only attempt possible here. We need a bad throw. Throw is on the mark, and we are way out. Wish you could perfectly put it in right center field every time, but that's pretty much where we want it. That's good enough. That roll is perfect. Perfect. I mean, it doesn't get better than that roll. We need to throw off the mark. It's off the mark. Get there, Ellie De La Cruz. We are in at Oracle. Four minutes, 45 seconds. That is not easy whatsoever, but we get it done in a pretty good amount of time. Now it's time for the NFL. And for the NFL, who else could it be besides the cheetah 
Tyreek Hill with 99 speed. Now, for Tyreek Hill, we'll be scoring a 99 yard touchdown, which for a lot of players would be difficult, but for a player with 99 speed and could probably be an Olympic sprinter, I don't think it'll be that challenging. The most challenging part might just be Tua to get the ball to Tyreek Hill. Because right now, we're getting pressured a lot. We got Stephon Gilmore on Tyreek. He cannot stay step for step with Tyreek. Tyreek can pretty much run around him. It's just the fact that Gilmore is giving him so much room because he knows he can beat him over the top. That might be a problem, but I see Gilmore flat-footed there. Air it out to a, to Tyreek Hill, and it's just that easy. The fastest one from the fastest player so far, and probably the fastest player we'll see in the entire video. And with two more sports to go, we are headed to the NHL. In the NHL, we have Connor McDavid, the best hockey player in the world, with 97 speed rating. He's won the fastest skater competition numerous times in his career. All right, Connor McDavid, let's take the open. Opening draw. Let's start the stopwatch. We lose the draw, which isn't good, but it doesn't really matter. We got to be in our own zone anyway. And the negative thing for Connor McDavid is that he's going to have to come off the ice compared to these other players that we didn't have that problem with. Well, let's get that puck. Come on. Let's get that puck to McDavid here. Curious to see how fast we can do this. He can get this done in one attempt. He's that good. Come on, get it to him. And it's not as far of a distance as it was in FC24 for Mbappe. And here comes McDavid. Come on, McDavid. You got to split two defenders here. Or not. Just work it in. And that would have been it. But McDavid could have put it home. We're going to skate up ice. Here we go. Save that speed. Here we go. Problem is I'm going to need timeouts too. But McDavid flying past. Maybe not. McDavid. Oh, what a poke check right there by Haskinen. The defenseman, if you didn't see it, just barely tapped the stick of McDavid. I was about to put it on the backhand and put it in, and now I'm out of stamina. And now McDavid is not as fast as he normally is, but he's still going in, and he doesn't score. We're getting the opportunities, McDavid, around our own net. We didn't lose the puck. We did not lose that. I'm going to count that right there. We didn't lose complete possession, but we did have to go around the net, so that's not going to count. Got to go all the way back around. You can't go around the net up top. You got to score when you get to the top. McDavid is drained. Now I've used my timeout. He's officially out of timeouts. Here we go. Around the net. Come on, McDavid. Why are we getting trapped on our own teammates here? We're getting stuck on our own teammates. Split the defenders. McDavid! No! It doesn't go in past Ottinger. Eventually. I'm feeling good about this shift. It's got to happen now. Come on. We're in the second period. McDavid, I thought you'd get this done in like a minute or two. Not six minutes. Here he goes. McDavid did not lose possession. And McDavid to start the second period. A coast to coast goal in six minutes. I got to stop the timer. 32 seconds. And now we finish in the NBA with the fastest player, De'Aaron Fox. Now for Fox, we're not going to test his speed. We are going to test how fast he can score a full court shot. Four full court shots, they are always hit or miss. So we are going to get ready here with Fox. You can get on the first attempt. It might take you 100 attempts. You are never due when it comes to full court shots. As someone who's made a lot of videos doing full court shots, it is so random. You never know when it's gonna go in sometimes it's taking curry 100 shots sometimes it's taking me with curry one shot so we will see i've never done that with De'Aaron fox so i'm curious to see that actually looks pretty good fox almost goes that got me excited i thought that was gonna go in oh that looks good too off the rim i'm looking for something to go in. oh that looks good come on fox <laughs> off the rim oh i thought that was it full court shot under like three minutes would have been super nice I really thought that was going in. Once you get past like five minutes, it starts to become brutal territory. So hopefully we don't get there, Fox. Hopefully. Oh, that looks good. Come on. That's got to be it. Off the back of the rim. An inch or two on a few of these attempts are the difference between hitting the full court shot and doing it for a long time. I'd like to now find around the middle of the rim. Yes, there it is. De'Aaron Fox. 4 minutes, 39 seconds. That's going to do it for the video, everyone. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor by hitting the like button and subscribing to the channel. And make sure to go check out my other channels, which are in the description down below. And I'll talk to you all in the next one. Peace.